Satnam, thank you so much for joining. Welcome to my channel. <sighs> so I'm gonna start off by saying, okay, well, thanks for being here. Um, yesterday I was in the comments and I said something, I, I replied to a comment and I said something along the lines of like, I think uh, from my perspective, confusion is a state of being um, that we experience when we resist our multidimensional self or we, we, we resist infinite possibility, okay? So if you've been having trouble um, understanding how uh, everything shit that's been happening to you has been your own creation or whatever, like, kind of try and look at it from that angle, okay? Or at least how you can change everything shit that's been happening to you or how you can alchemize it or whatever, okay? So I'm going to be like... Because I know some people get a little bit touchy in, on, on like victim blaming or whatever. But like if you're if you're touchy on something like that, then like you're still in victim mentality. Okay. As we know. What's happening? So the three of pentacles with the eight of swords. <clears throat> <coughs> There's a lot of messages coming through, but all of the messages coming through seem a little bit, I just heard peculiar. They seem a little bit like small almost, because I wanted to say shit like, you're doing really well, and like, you know, small steps make big leaps, and you know, shit like that. But it's kind of like, like, we know this though, like, we know this. Even what I shared at the beginning, maybe, it's like, like, you've already heard this, or you have had that um, awareness experience before, maybe. Um, that might be just some of you because all of a sudden now I'm getting this energy of like, no, no, I needed to hear this or no, I need this or like, I need to see it this way. So seeing, seeing it, seeing it, um, seeing, seeing suffering even from this previous perspective, like I mentioned, confusion as seeing suffering from that perspective even, um, leads to, uh, degenerate jesus leads to a a, a, a regeneration of like non-suffering i feel like collective i feel like you you are not just sidestepping but it's it's kind of like 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 you're reaching some kind of like um experience within yourself where the stepping stones that you're that you're like walking on or the the small steps you're taking are are like are not seen as small okay like the small steps are are i don't want to say like seen by others as big but like it's it's almost like things that used to seem like leaps to you seem so small to you now okay like things that like um, thought processes and ideas and like inspirations and like even actions that you take um, that that used to seem like profound to you like it's 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 starting to seem like like not just your everyday reality but like it's starting to seem minuscule to you. So it's kind of like the energy as I came into this reading and like it like I went for some kind of loop because it started out I was like You get what I'm saying? So what do you do with this now though? Like you integrate it, of course, you experience it, of course. I'm feeling I'm feeling a little bit of a of a density. Or a fear in regards to, um, not will this be enough, but it's almost like, is there enough? Like, is there enough? Is there, is there, like, if I reach this kind of, like, um, placid thought process, to you it might seem placid or something, like, what else can there be, right? Like, I feel like there's that kind of fear. So maybe, maybe, or, or, or like, like not fear, but like, like thought, okay? So maybe this is also your highest kind of like um, starting to slow you down a little bit. Um, because like the giant leaps seem like small steps to you now, like you can slow down tremendously. Like you're allowed to, or you're, you're, you're able to, uh, slowed down tremendously now, okay? 
I'm hearing that song move out the way because here come giants, right? Like it's like one small step for man, one giant leap for man. <laughs> you know, <laughs> every small step you're taking now is a giant leap for you. And so it's kind of like because you're becoming so big or like energetically, I feel like you're about to become much slower. As well, okay. So taking back your power. This card keeps coming up. I'm getting like very, very ancient energy again, okay? Like, 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 like ancient, like, like uh, turtle fucking dinosaur or like ancient, okay? And it's, it's, it's giving, it's giving this energy of like, like being a gentle giant or something, taking back your power. Like, you recognize now that even just a small step you take like has like maybe profound consequences and shit like that. And so that's why you're slowing down. So you're taking back your power literally by just recognizing that you're super fucking big, okay? Like giant steps. I keep getting giant steps. Taking back your power. Like this is giving me strength card energy. And I'm seeing you like walk over fortresses and like walls and like towers and shit. Like literally just stepping over them. I'm, I keep trying to remember what the beginning of this message was about, the beginning of this whole reading, but I can't get to that energy. And I feel like it's because it's it's become so small as well. It's kind of like, like I, I keep trying to, I'm like, what, what, huh? You know, but I, I just can't get to it. So, like, I, I remember doing a reading a while ago about, like, like, like our, 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 our collective energies becoming, like, giant, okay? And I feel like, I feel like you're experiencing this now. You might actually, like, a lot of you, a lot of, a lot of us might be experiencing, like, um, like, teleportation and shit, like, like, biolocation, or, for a lot of us, I don't know, but something like that, but, like, in reality, you're, like, literally actually just taking a few steps or some shit like that, okay? Like, spiritually, you're taking a few steps, that's how you're able to, like, be somewhere else all of a sudden. <laughs> what? <laughs> You are safe. I am protecting you against your lower energies and guarding you, your loved ones, and home. Patience. Like, I got the sense of being carried on, the, on like, the hands of the angels or some shit, right? I'll make it to heaven even if the gods don't want me in. Maybe, like, that's the, the threshold you're, 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 crossing, you're, you're crossing over, like, you're, you're stepping over into... Just bear with me quickly. I feel like, interesting, I feel like this you are safe card is actually not for you. I feel like it's more for you in a sense of like, because I'm, I'm even now seeing like the elephants there. It's kind of like your highest is telling you like, it's safe to take steps. It's safe to walk because I feel like a lot of you might even have a little bit of a fear of your own power because you, you recognize that you simply say something or you throw a pebble or you like like do this to somebody and then shit happens and like you know shit like that is because you're so fucking big. I feel like God is telling you like like it's safe to act. It's safe to act. Like don't be afraid that you're gonna hurt or maim, okay? <laughs> It's safe to act, okay? Like, like, don't be afraid of acting from your power. Like, you're not going to hurt anybody. And if somebody gets hurt, like, why do? Taking back your power. Like, why are you standing there? Like, you, you obviously, like, they saw you coming. Or some shit like that, okay? I feel like that's sufficient. Um, thank you so much. Please do consider doing the thing. And I'll see you again for another one. Bye.